Here's a fun fact. President Teddy Roosevelt invited boxers to the White House to fight him. But that all came to an end one day when a military aide hit the president so hard he lost sight in his left eye. I'm not making this up. Roosevelt acknowledged I had become an elderly man and would have to stop boxing. But his fighting days weren't over. Roosevelt took up martial arts instead and later received an honorary black belt in judo. Teddy Roosevelt loved a good fight. The Bible challenges us to a good fight too. The good fight of faith. 1 Timothy 6.12 says, Fight the good fight for the faith. Keep holding on to eternal life, to which you were called, and about which you gave a good testimony in front of many witnesses. Notice our faith is a fight, but it's a good fight, because we're fighting for eternal life, and we're fighting for the calling God has put on our lives, and we're fighting for our testimony and the impact it has on the witnesses we live and work with. Let's pray. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. We praise you, Lord, that you go ahead of us and fight for us. Can you think of a time when God went ahead of you and fought a battle for you? Let's think about that for a moment. And let's take a moment and thank God for fighting our battles for us and with us. May your kingdom come and your will be done, Lord. And your will is that I fight the good fight of faith today. What battle are you and I fighting today? And how is our battle a witness to others? Give us this day our daily bread. We need strength to fight the battle. We need endurance. We need encouragement. Let's take a moment and tell God what we need in our fight today. And lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil. Lord, the good fight is a battle against sin and temptation. Let's ask the Lord to help us be strong in the face of temptation today and to deliver us from evil so that we can walk in freedom and forgiveness. Lord, our hearts are full of praise and thanks because you go ahead of us and fight for us. And our hearts are filled with purpose as we do your will, fighting the good fight of faith today. And our hearts are filled with peace as we trust you to give us what we need in the good fight today. And our hearts are filled with freedom as we let go of the sin that so easily entangles us in the good fight. Yours, Lord, is the battle and the good fight and the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. If you'd like a transcript of today's prayer, just click the link in the description below or go to lordsprayerday.com.